Hey, welcome back everybody. It's great to be with you. Uh, beautiful day here at Belmont Abbey College, um, down by the Grotto, Our Lady of Lourdes. Uh, wonderful things going on this weekend. We have family weekend and we welcome uh, back families to kind of reunite with their, their sons and daughters here. And we have some fun things going on. Uh, people arriving uh, on Friday, Friday night, we have a uh, river jam. Uh, concert at the Whitewater Center, which is uh, always a great event. It's beautiful. If you've never been there before, I highly recommend it. Uh, the next day, I know we have kind of a scavenger hunt. We have some uh, opportunities to socialize, parents to get together to socialize with the Parent Association. And then on Sunday, I know that we have uh, Sunday Mass and uh, I think a kind of a departing brunch. So just a nice weekend for everybody to get together and look forward to it. It's also a meaningful weekend in that this is 9-11 on Sunday. And uh, you've heard me talk about it before, and being from New York, uh, my parents actually lived down in Battery Park City, which was only a couple of blocks away from the World Trade Centers. And I have to tell you, even to this day, I almost can't get over that they're not there. It was just a horrific, horrific uh, event, uh, tragedy. And uh, I, I continue to always pray for the individuals that not only were killed at the World Trade Center, but at the Pentagon and in Pennsylvania, uh, just, uh, you know, horrific. And one of the things that touches me most are those individuals that gave their lives in trying to save others. So I look at the firefighters and police officers uh, who, can you imagine going up the World Trade Center, up 80, over 80 stories, probably like 100 pounds of, you know, oxygen tanks, your full, you know, you know, coat, jacket, helmets. I mean, just think of the heat of the whole thing, having to walk up 81 stories, knowing that you're going into literally an inferno. Um, just, it, 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 it just, I don't know, I, I, you can tell, I, I'm short of words because I don't know how to adequately describe someone who is just willing to give their lives for a stranger, not knowing them and yet knowing that they wanted to go up there and try to rescue them. Um, just uh, an amazing tribute and one of our alumnus, uh, Jimmy Riches, uh, was a firefighter who gave his life that day trying to rescue those. So it's especially poignant for the Abbey uh, and for myself, as I said, from New York. And I'm sure for many of you, uh, it's something that I don't think in my lifetime, I don't think anybody can ever forget that, that witnessed it, whether it was on you know, television or in person. And Jimmy Riches, again, being from Belmont Abbey, just brings it home here even more so. So this Sunday, uh, we're hoping for good weather. We've heard it might rain, but uh, barring the rain, we're going to actually have a dedication, a blessing of the flagpole that's out uh, in the athletic fields. Uh, Mr. Mike Snyder, Karen and Mike Snyder, uh, donated that generously to us. And uh, Mr. Snyder felt especially strong about, he didn't want to dedicate it to him, he wanted to dedicate it to Jimmy Riches. And so we'll do that on Sunday, again, if, if weather permitting. But again, uh, keep those individuals, families especially. Uh, I trust, I know, where, I know where all those good people are right now. And uh, I, it, it's most difficult and challenging, I'm sure, for their families, especially at this time of year. So special prayers go out for them as well. Um, and with that, you know, again, just, Activities here keep going, construction, classes, uh, just uh, events, speaking engagements, all kinds of things, theater. Uh, the place is alive and uh, so much happening here. It's just been really a wonderful start to the year. I uh, also don't want to forget uh, Ansley Froman, who's the uh, assistant uh, acro tumbling coach. It's her birthday. So if you see her, uh, please wish her uh, a happy birthday. And uh, with that, I just hope to see you on campus sometime soon. So until then, take care and God bless.